Hey guys, how you doing? This is your boy Nate Gaming, and welcome back to my channel today, guys. Today I am doing another video showcasing another bike from the Biker DLC. So uh, today we are reviewing a returning vehicle from GTA 4, the Zombie. Now, which has also been kind of renamed to the Zombie Chopper. <laughs> Which I'm not 100% sure if it was called the, the Zombie Chopper. I've always known that the Zombie on GTA 4. But this is a vehicle returning from GTA 4. Um, now, as you imagine, you know, I wouldn't actually expect, you know, a lot of, you know, customization because, you know, it just came from GTA 4. But there is a lot of customization. Um, now, this bike is not the fastest bike in the game. It's not the slowest bike in the game, but it's, you know, the uh, the speed is fair, I say. Um, but I do enjoy this bike a lot. I actually kind of miss this bike from uh, GTA from GTA 5 because, um, to me, this, this bike really felt like it should have been in the game in the first place due to, you know, its history and how such a good bike it is. I mean, it totally fits GTA 5's criteria. Than even some of these other bikes, but yeah, you know, this is a a really classic bike. Really, I, I really like it. Um, handling's alright. You know, it's not it's not GTA 4 handling, which I actually almost kind of prefer that with the bikes, at least for um yeah, at least for the bikes because um if you played the Lost and Damned and compared that to the original GTA 4 bike handling that was pretty 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 horrible so if that's the only thing that's really kind of bothering me about this biker DLC is that we didn't have the lost and damned or even the Battle the gay Tony bike handling put into the game for GTA 5 which would have really made for like really good like stunts and you know, just, just crazy stuff you can do on the road, you know? So, anyways, enough of me babbling. I'm gonna go and customize this bike, and I'm gonna show off my finished product in a couple of seconds. Okay, so we are back. So, um, making this, so when I customized this bike, I went for a American flag theme, which I do actually kind of like, which is also brings out another statement which uh, we don't really need the 4th of July DLC anymore with the fact that you can put the American flag livery on most of these bikes I found out so in a way um, Souvenir or whatever you call that bike um, it's not really needed anymore just all now all we're just looking for now is a plain version of that bike and we'll be golden I think but anyways Another feature I wanted to show, and the only way I'm going to be able to really show it, is when I'm off the bike. So, this, I think, is a new function put in by Rockstar. So, um, if you can see right here, this is, and you know what, I think I can probably zoom in a little bit closer with my camera. That right there is a brand new function added by Rockstar. Uh, it's like a uh, the belts moving on the bike, so I thought that was really, really kind of cool to put that on the bike as well. Um, I put a little bit of chrome on the outside, like on the bars and stuff, because you really couldn't change the first dairy color because, well, you know, it's covered by an American flag. But yeah, that's the bike. Um, so um, I'm gonna test out how fast. What's, if there's any like difference in, in the speed or anything, even the handling. Hmm. It's uh basically the same. Um the speed is a little bit better as any car or vehicle that gets upgraded would react. Yeah, this, um, it's really good. Um, the speed is perfect. 
it's like I said, it's not the fastest, not the slowest. It is a chopper bike. Remember that. But yeah, you know, just great to see this bike in a GTA 5. You know, I mean, some people I know that a lot of people out there complain about, you know, oh, you know, they just port another bike from GTA 4 over to GTA 5. I want to see something new. Well, that's something I don't I can't really agree with some people I really would like to see some of those old GTA 4 cars make an appearance in GTA 5 if anything I'd like to see them in GTA 6 but that's a little bit talk about from my head that game's not even due out yet but. but yeah anyways this is the western zombie chopper bike a bike that returned from GTA 4 that is been included in the biker themed update for GTA 5 online well, that's all the time I have for in this video. I hope to see you in my next video showcasing another bike on this very awesome Biker DLC.